Welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zelot from Geek Tech Industries. And we are here tonight doing the Iron Man Season 7 competition. Um, this is kind of between missions here. I'm just kind of getting some more resources together, getting all my stuff together before I go assault the... Um, abandoned factory on Omicron here. So in the meantime, I've also finished off my base and I'll show you that here. So as you can see, uh, I've built, I actually added some more layers to it and built it up. So this is on top of what used to be, the roof is actually below us now and I'll show you that. So this is all combat. Uh, well, it's, it's, um, what do they call it? Armored glass. And the concrete is now uh, armored concrete that supports the the turrets. Oh, looks like I missed some texturing some here. The, there'll be touch-ups to do. So <clears throat> today, what I wanted to do is not just show off the, the close to, well, pretty much finished base. I mean, there's little little things to do here and there maybe but so this used to be the roof i moved the got rid of the uh panels the solar panels and i'll show you what i did with those i i kept the um furnace up here and i just um sectioned it off and i put all a whole bunch of cargo boxes up here and labeled them all and got and i've been mining so yeah i've got you know some good amounts of ore, decent amount of sath, not much neo though. That's not cool. And of course, you know, I do have some stuff in the constructors, but not a lot. I don't really have an, and, and of course the restroom is a big problem, big problem. Um, so I think today we can we can probably do something about the Neo and maybe a little bit of the arrest room. I think we want to go visit Ninga's. So let's go downstairs. Uh, well, actually, you guys have seen all downstairs. Let's just let's just go. Um, oh yeah, we got to go down to the this floor, my hangar floor. Well, that's interesting. The light coming through there is. That's cool, the sunlight. Anyway, so there's the sun coming up on a beautiful day on Omicron, and I'm not wearing my helmet. That's intelligent. Oh, I got touch-ups to do here on the pad. So I've also finished off here. I'll let me spawn my drone. I built a much bigger pad here. Oh, a little bit of dirt clear-up to do over there. Some some more. I got to finish off the... Um, the armoring of, of the pad out here. I didn't really armor the pad. I've just made the, finished off the tower here. So we've, we basically have our finished base. As much as I want to deal with it, it's, it's, it suits our needs fine now. It, it you know, it does everything we need it to. I'm hoping the I'm hoping the pad is going to be big enough that I'll be able to spawn the CV in that I'm cooking in the factory right now. I showed you guys that last episode and I lost all that time. And so I've been, I've spent a whole bunch of time in the past couple of days. Just, you know, as you can see, I've, I've, I've been doing stuff and mining and up over there is where I actually put all these solar panels on their own little platform up out of the way no obstruction so right now they're probably getting some optimal sun let's take a look at here we'll just um let's get in the uh, cv so that we're not wasting oxygen here because apparently you use less in a contained environment like uh, a building or a capital vessel so um well, 
I guess what we can do is I think I've got everything ready to go. I want to go visit the trading station on Ningas 2. And I've, I've fueled it all up. I think we should be ready. Oh, you know what I should do first is... You know what I forgot to do? Did I did I grab them? Did I do I got them? No. Oh yeah, I do. Okay, so I want to add a couple more homing rocket homing rocket launchers on the SV. So let's check out where can I do that. I could knock a block out there and put them there. That's not a bad idea. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. So let's uh, disassemble. Is that going to work then? Yeah. Okay. And then we'll put the second ones in. A second pair. So this should make it so that I don't have to is that going in enough? No, it's not, right? It's not? Darn. Well, I can have it forward like that. That's not that big of a deal, is it? Is that going to fit in there like that? Yeah. Good enough. I don't care if it's forward more than the other one. That shouldn't really matter. Okay. More guns. Woo! More rockets. So that should enable him to take out a turret on a single shot now instead of having to come back for it. So I should put myself at less risk now with that. Uh, what are they actually hit point wise too? So they have 300 hit points. So I removed a block that had 200 hit points. Replace it with a block that has 300 hit points. So that even actually gives me more nose armor in a sense, right? They're harder to take out. Um, yeah. So there we go. Uh, should I paint them? I don't have the tool on me. Forget it. Good enough for now. <clears throat> Let's just get going. Let's go to Ningas. So. Whoops. Why did I... Why did I do that? Let's do this instead. And turn our engines on. So we're top everything up here. Make sure that I have what I need on me. I'm, I'm bringing a bunch of stuff for trade. Uh, I've built a bunch of more weapons that I'm going to be taking to the abandoned factory with me. And this stuff is all extra stuff, except, well, except for the Pentaxon, of course. But, um, yeah, so we're going to try and sell some stuff. I do have quite a few credits. I have 118,000 credits. So we're not we're not like broke by any means. It's just I might as well get rid of what I the surplus I have. Oh, that's not surplus. That that should have went in the the uh, SV. We can do that when we jump in it later. So let's just go. <clears throat> I guess I can go show you the uh, the panels. I mean. It, pretty basic I just made a a tiered little platform and then got them all angled in there so they all have uh, four lights for the most part except for this one on the side but they all got four lights and it cranks it 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 actually um, powers more than powers it throughout the day as long as I don't have the furnace turned on for no reason of course but uh, so there we go that's my base it's pretty much done hopefully done depending on the um, size of my CV that I spawn in I, I should be okay <sighs> well we'll try and get some stuff at the trading station and we'll see if we can get some Neo at uh, Ninges. We haven't been to Ninges yet. This isn't the 
fastest CV in the world, and that's why I'm trading it up for a much better one. But until it's finished cooking, which is going to be probably not until the middle of next week sometime. <laughs> uh, okay. And yes, I did put full blocks in. I got ripped off. I got a bug hit me, and it resorted back to max time after I had pretty much filled the thing and had it down to six hours spawn time from 18. And it went back up to 18. Still had all my mats in it, but it went back up to 18 hours. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, so let's figure out where we are here. And we want to go to Zahines, then to Ningas. Okay. So, preferably I want to try and try and find some Neo ast asteroids. I don't really feel like landing anywhere. I don't feel like dealing with a CV if we don't need to, or I should say a planetary vessel, but we might have to. And those missile, the extra missile launchers will help too. So, let's go. Here we go. And aim this thing down. And oh, let me add about 65 there. So I had to be moving at about 65 meters a second. Okay. Uh, oh, look at the pretty, pretty clouds of nebula or whatever you want to call them, of particles and gas and okay um moving on let's warp to ningas down here come on it's always exactly behind me right every time and oh maybe it wasn't yeah i don't want to jump out of the ship come on Okay, let's check this out. We've got Neo, Sath, Promethium, Iron, Cobalt, and Copper in... Oop, whoa, what's red? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so this is the... Can't see any asteroids. The only ones that you'll ever find are ones that actually are resource asteroids. So what I usually do is... Well, let's fill that up. Um, I'll level out, and then I'll try and get even with the equator of the planet. This We're going to have to deal with this guy. He's, he's, he's going to... He's going to bring a poo-poo party to the parade here, so... Let's just... Let's just kill him. Okay. Well, stop. Okay. Well, that should be good. Turn our jet back on. And... Oh, you know what? Hang on here. Hang on. Before you ever dismount from a vehicle in space because of bugs... You need to make sure you are wearing an Evo Boost. Yeah, that's why I had that with me. There we go. Now, if I get ejected out of my vehicle, out into space, I'm not going to be killed instantly. And let's spawn our drone. Just come on, let me out, let me out, let me out. Oh, man, yeah. 23 energy. That's not bad, actually. That's not bad. I'm not gonna poo poo that. Uh, okay, so let's get back to the we want to level off. And we're, we're pretty, we're close enough to the equator. So now what I want to do is I want to get in to about 4,000 kilometers, maybe 
3,500. Oh, there's an asteroid right there. I just, did you guys see that pop in? And that looks like Sath, maybe? It's not, we don't actually need Sath. Cobalt. Oh, well, that's nice and all. We'll, uh, we'll mark that. Okay, um, so we'll, st we'll keep heading towards the planet first. Let's continue to try and stay level. Okay, so now that we're 3,500, I, what I want to do is I just want to do a full sweep around the planet once until we get to close to the trading station. Because I just want to find... as many asteroids that I can here. So you can see I'm trying to, oh, there's another one that just popped in. So this is the trick to finding them, people. I mean, it, it works for me all the time. And you can see it's about the, this one's quite out there. This one's like 5k and it's Prometheum. That's nice. So I'm just going to mark that. Just going to mark that. I don't need it right now. Okay. And then we'll head back. Oh, see, there's another asteroid. That one looks like Sathium. And that indeed is. Okay, so we'll mark that. Or waypointed, I should say. And we'll continue. We're a little we're a little close at this point, and I want to level off again. So let's head back out in this direction a bit, try and get out into the about the three and a half K out. Seems to see it. There we go. There's one that just popped in there. And what is this one? Can't tell. I can't see what it's iron. Okay. That's fine. We'll, um, We'll put a waypoint on that one. We're just going to waypoint everything right now until we find either Neo or get to the uh, trading station. So let's level off again. Make sure that we are about at equator height. Okay. You can see there's there's drones over there. So we gotta. We're still not. You know, we're not necessarily safe, but. Oh, there's another asteroid that just popped in into view there. That is hard to tell what it is. It could be, I'm not sure. It's got some dark markings, maybe Prometheum. Is that what was here? I'm not sure. Neo, perfect. There we go, okay. Okay, so This is awesome. Well, we found that really quick. Um, okay, well, I, th I think I'm going to show off the CV drill then because, you know what, we've, we've got time here. We've got time. Let's do this. So this is how I've gotten a whole bunch of resources now is this drill. It's just fantastic. What you want to do is you want to get the, the node that you can see on the asteroid um, just at about the same, the bottom of it, you want to get about level with the, with the bottom of your drill, really, because your drill can't really shoot down very well, but it can shoot up really high. So, 
And then you want to get fairly close. I mean, closer than that. So I can get, I can get in there. So there, I should be able to, I should be able to aim up high enough to get that whole spot there. So let's jump in our um, drill now. And I'll just scroll down to it. And we're facing the wrong way. Ooh, what's that? That's an interesting thing. Huh. Is that the trade station? Kind of looks like it's moving. No, I don't think it is. Okay. So I think we're okay. Let's just... I don't see any red arrows. So let's just do this. So you only have one mode on the CV drill. <laughs> um, and that is just push the button and it drills. Uh, I, can't, I don't think I can get my radar back. No, I cannot. That's unfortunate. That's the only thing I don't really like about the CV drill and the... Uh, um, the multi turrets, I believe, also is the same way that you can't you can't have your radar going at the same time. I mean, sure, you get your your red arrow thing on your screen, but if you don't really notice it right off the bat, you could be in trouble. So I like to just keep working away at the oops outside of it. You can see how fast the ore is coming in. <clears throat> So it's a really great way of fairly safely mining. It's it's kind of relaxing when you're in deep space and you're in a spot where there's no vessels ever come and and if you got enough food and oxygen and energy, well, you can sit there for hours mining and mining and yep. There is a certain zen to this, to, to CV mining. It's it's way more peaceful and less hands-on than the HV mining. The HV mining can get a little crazy and you're trying to control it while you're driving and you're flipping around. And the CV mine is just more, I don't know, there's more zen to it. It just feels better. Personally, I, I I would like it if they flip back to this format of ore instead of the little nuggets on in the ground, because I find I found this to be more enjoyable to to mine, and yeah, maybe overall it was slower, but I don't know. I just even controlling an HV in this type of ore on a on a planet, the old type of deposit, you know, alpha, pre-alpha seven deposits. They, I found them easier to mine with both types of drills. Okay, so that pretty much looks like I, I'll just knock this down a little bit here, see if there's anything left here, a little bit. Okay, I think I got that vein a little bit there okay uh, and then we can just jump out of the drill and we're instantly I don't bother turning off the thrusters because in space they don't seem to use up much power if you're not using them at all they so it's not so bad they're fairly efficient if you're not pushing the button okay so let's Figure out our height here that we want to get to. So we want to get to about the same, the, the bottom of the drill for the bottom of the node. And then to the point where it might be a little bit of a problem aiming up to get 
that that's going to be good right there. Let's just jump in and keep mining. And the great thing about this too is it's not exposing your character to potential dangers by jumping out of your vehicle and and mining uh, and and having a problem getting back in your vehicle. So I consider it a much safer way of mining. One of the safer ways actually in the game. You don't get stuck. You can't get your HV stuck. <laughs> I don't know if anyone knows what I'm talking about, but yeah, you can you can actually have to abandon the vehicle sometimes if you didn't bring a drill with you and and you get your your HV stuck and and auto leveling doesn't get you out. Yeah, it can be a problem. Okay, so let's jump out of this and there's some more here. Good. Get it as close to levels. See, we're quite a distance away now. We'll come in. And we'll go down a bit. Okay. That looks good. This is as far as I can go down, so I just got it. You can see it's... Um, It's a good, very useful tool. It's the very first thing I save up for when I'm level 20. <clears throat> um, probably one of the most useful tools in the game is the CV drill, in my opinion. I use it quite a bit. Quite a bit. I haven't actually been using the multi turret for the CV though, because I always have one on my HV, and I find that to be just more maneuverable. I'm, I'm thinking I should try it though, to see what the range is. It might even have a better range than the. Actually, you know what? We could probably take a look really quick. Let's just. It'll probably tell us, right? So. The. That's a drill turret. Multi turret for the CV has a max range of 80. The multi turret for an HV has a max range of 50. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh. Well, that's interesting. Mount one of those on the top, on the very front of my tiny little CV and use that for multi multi turreting down stuff and repairing stuff huh you know that's um that's a good idea it's very expensive though isn't it 10 alloy like pretty much everything a couple of oscillators and a power coil yikes yeah way more expensive than the uh, than the HV one Oof way more expensive yeah and that's one of the reasons why I don't make it because you know if I already have one on the HV it's like well sure it doesn't quite have the range but it's still very functional uh, actually while I'm into the control panel let me eat really quick here so we'll just grab yeah that ham looks good and maybe a chunk of cheese or two good enough okay Okay, so let's see what else we got here. We've got a strip here. Get our alignment all set up here. We can get in a little bit closer. Although I'm not going to be able to reach that hole up, am I? Why? I probably don't get, need to get much closer. It's probably not super deep, so we'll just 
get into the drill turret here and start drilling it. Always got to be on a lookout for the uh, red arrows, looking for red arrows all the time on the sides of my peripheral vision. It's one of the keys to surviving in this game, actually, and you know, not having your stuff get destroyed is, is seeing the red before and the red is in your eyes as blood. You can see how fast this is. This is great. Really great. The only thing that's actually faster is six six uh, laser drills on the HV combined can out drill a CV, but but you know, by a narrow margin, really. This thing has a crazy range though compared to the uh, HVs. And they can't have obviously work in space. <laughs> but they do work on moons. A little bit more. A little bit more. <laughs> A little a sharp little vein there going in. Mm, looks like I'd, I'm just getting stone now. Yeah, okay. So, I think I saw another deposit here somewhere on this thing. Oh, 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 oh. What do we got here? Right here. And up there. Okay. So let's get close. It's funny how deceiving it is in a capital vessel, the distances. Okay, so let's go there. It might be a little too close. Let's just back off a bit. See if I can get the stuff on the top. And jump back in the turret. I know this is kind of boring for you guys, but I think what I'll do is I'll, I mean, it's not taking too, too long to, to mine this out. It's just, I don't know what else to really show you guys in between missions. I've already done tons of civilian POIs on, you know, I've done, I don't know, probably at least half a dozen and I don't really need to do anymore. I've got all the kits that I kind of need right now and the factory will probably give me more if I if I survive. So I think you know let's just finish this off here. We'll just get this last little chunk and then we'll head over to the trading station and see what we can purchase and sell. So that looks good right there. All right, so this will this will probably be enough Neo now for the end of the Iron Man series. I'm not really sure what I'd be using the Neo for at this point, to tell you the truth. Um, although, I don't know, I just, I don't know what the end mission is. I don't know what the mission is after the abandoned factory. So we'll have to see. Okay, I think that's it for the asteroid now. I think I completely gutted it. Yeah, okay. So, let's head on over. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to mark this on my map now that I've gutted it. So I'm going to actually change his name to Dunn. Okay. Um, so, trading station. Let's, let's head there. Let's see what we actually got here, too. 
Okay, so we got, um, oh, we still had some stuff from, left over from, I didn't know there was, oh, let's check the other container. Did I not empty this thing? Yeah. Okay, I only emptied one of them. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We've got lots of space. So, yeah, that'll help. That's, you know, that's another 2,700 or so, so 2,600. 2600 Neo, uh, still got some more Zascosium to smelt, and a whole bunch of magnesium, so we're, we're, we're doing really good on magnesium now. I don't think we're ever going to run out of missiles. The big problem is the CV missiles, which require a restroom also. I've made a whole bunch of them, but damn, the, the amount of a restroom that's eating up is ridiculous. I, I can't really afford to make any more. Okay, we'll deal with this space drone. He's going to be a problem here, so. And we'll just grab him. Grab his bits. Hopefully he has some good bits for us. Make sure jetpack's on, yep. Okay. Okay. Good, and jump out, spawn the drone, get it up there, and let's see what we got. Oh, there was stuff. Wow, and 17 more, wow, 40 from two drones, 40 energy packs from, that's, <clears throat> that's funny. That's a lot, actually. All this stuff helps. All this stuff helps. But at this point, I've actually got a lot of Promethium. I don't need anything besides a restroom, really. I, I mean, a restroom is the hard, super hard thing to get right now. Uh, okay, so let's let's go into here and just we'll just we'll add a waypoint. That way, it's much easier to pinpoint exactly where it is. It's on the other side of Ninges. So what I'm hoping to do is medical stuff. I want as many kits as I can get and as much a restroom as I can get. Um, I don't know about weapons kits. I mean, I should probably think about I've got another suit of armor that I, heavy armor that I purchased that's that's in mint condition, unused. And I don't know. I mean, I've got all the boosts that I really want at this point. I think it's just medical equipment and a restroom really is the two big things that I really that I need. And I guess some some of the ammos too, if I some of the ones that require a restroom that I can use like for the for the uh, CV um, rocket launchers. So I don't see any other um, I don't see any carriers around or or freighters. I still have yet to kill a rocket drone, really? Huh. So, let's level out. And we'll... Oops. Just, uh... Actually, let's back off a bit here. Now, do they have, uh... No. So let's get in through here then. That's fine. Um, you know what? I'm going to back up to it. I'm going to back up to it. Yeah. Oh, is that an asteroid out there? That's an asteroid out there. Let's let's just go mark that for a second here. <laughs> uh, what are you, my friend? You are, oh, iron, okay, well, that's fine. 
That's fine. If we need iron, we know where to come. We've got a couple of them out here now. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll just Yeah, turn around. I'll turn around. And then... Is that... It's not bad. Let's get... Let's get close enough, at least. So... And then we'll go like this. And... Like this. Whoops. Come on. And, oops, <laughs> I'll just uh, use bumper, bumper car. Okay, uh, that should be fine. Nothing's around, nothing's around to shoot at me. No, do I see any more asteroids around? Those are planets, by the way. Most of the, all those perfectly round ones out in the distance, those are all the other planets. Okay, let's get out. And we'll go check out the uh, trading station. So let's not have any weapons in our hands, because that can be a bad thing if you accidentally shoot at somebody. Okay. Hey, come on, let me in. And I know for a fact none of these I'll be able to, yeah. Let's turn my light on for you. And what's this? Is this, this where we go in? Maybe. Looks like it. And, okay. And that just wow. Um, okay, through here then? Nope. <laughs> okay. Uh, can I just get in over here then? You know, since it's just a freaking hassle. <laughs> here we go. This looks like promising. Ah, uh, thanks, bud. Okay, uh, hangers, yeah. What's this? Other faction, huh? Really? So, can I like go down? No? Wow. Um. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here's an elevator. Oh, and I hear dudes. Here we go. Okay. And other faction. And what? Are you kidding me? No. I well, how the hell did I get into this place? What? Okay. Um. Okay, I'm I'm confused. There's no. Uh, I'm obviously missing something. Here we go. Okay, so this will get me into here, and then welcome to mail trade. Oh, okay, okay. So should I get the CV? It's way over there. If I run into problems, it's going to be a pain in the ass getting back, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. So let's just let's just move it. <laughs> Although I'm wasting time right now, I could have just went in there. Let's just do <laughs> let's just go. Oh yeah. So indecisive. Okay, so let's check this out. Welcome to Milo Trading Station. 
Okay, and then do we go up then? Yeah, it says trading here. Okay, so we should be able to just turn our jetpack off. Okay, so here we go. Here we go. We've got a toilet. Yeah, great. Um, well, we can warp down to the planet from here, I bet. Yep, okay. And what other... So hangar... And, ooh, that goes up somewhere. Now let's go into third person just so it doesn't get so jittery. And, okay, so he wants my wine, right? Yeah. Nice. Okay. I've just made so much of this wine, and it actually makes you sick if you drink too much of it. So it's, it's kind of, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Um, yeah. He's got nothing I want, right? No. No. Okay. Okay. And let's... What? That's it? Take some free oxygen? Yeah. Um, arms and service, okay. Oh, well, servant corp. This guy will, s he will buy my medium armor. Nice. Um, the oxygen. Nice. Okay, and what else? What else will he buy? Does he want my biofuel? Sure. <laughs> okay. That's uh, all he's got, eh? Okay. Okay. What about him? Interweb. Yeah, I think he has some stuff. I think he'll buy some stuff. Got a looted T2 shotgun. Will he buy that? No. No, he'll buy everything else except for a T2 shotgun. Bastard. Um, plasma cannon cell. Rocket launcher homing missile. It's all handheld stuff. So it's all handheld stuff. Okay. I know where to buy kits from if I need to. Okay. Huh. Buy pulse rifle, T2 pulse rifle from them. Okay. Uh, that's interesting. Yep. Um, well, I guess we'll go down to Ningas, right? Crash DSC back. Plasma drone, minigun drone. If it was a rocket drone, I'd come down here and kill it, but... Uh, okay. So, let's see. What do we got here? What's over here? Stairs down. Okay. And... What do we got? What do we got? We've got interweb. Same thing. Will he buy my shotgun? Oh, he'll buy my shotgun. Okay. Um, what else? Sells heavy armor. All the same sort of stuff. Okay. Good to know. Oh, I should have brought a bunch of my minigun rounds. He would have bought, like, quite a bit. At 44 a pop, too. Wow. Would have been a few grand. Okay. What's this guy do? 
Uh, oh, I should have brought my auto miner core and sold that because I'm not going to use it. What else? What else? Copper ingots. Here we go. So we'll sell 300. And no, oh, he's not gonna buy more. Oh, right. Okay, so I'm maxed out on that. That's not bad though. Okay, and then what else? Will he buy silicon? Yep. So he'll buy what? Three eighty. Three seventy. Three seventy. And we'll just max that out. Okay, and then he sells Neo. And what about a restroom? No. Restroom gel? No. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to find anyone that does that. Should I buy the Neo? Don't necessarily need it. It's cheaper than copper. <laughs> really? Really? Can I? Okay, what the hell? <laughs> I'm not really sure if I need it though. Um, refined pentaxid. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure if I. I just mined out that that asteroid. I'm not sure if I need it now as badly. I mean, I only got the, I did the asteroid just because I was low on it and just, okay, this guy has a medical, right? Right, come on. Yes. So, we'll buy everything he's got there. Uh, antidote pills, we'll buy everything of those. Excellent. And I don't see any small ones. Now, if we take the, the plasma, we buy all that. We buy that. Uh, we do the alien spike lemon. Um, we know all this other crap too, don't we? Confetti moss. And... Um, what else? I'm full now. I'm full. Damn. I'm actually getting hungry too, almost. Don't want to eat that. Yeah. Uh, so I do need to figure out what I need to make. So, okay, so garden, little store. Let's see. What's he got? Oh, and I can buy more of those from him too. Okay, so I need to figure out what I need to make... I gotta head back and take a look, I think, because I don't think it's on my schematic at all anywhere. Yeah. Okay, let's just, we'll just head back really quick. We'll dump off all the stuff. It doesn't seem that I can, wait, no, let's, is there more traders up there? Maybe there's somebody that'll buy my multi-tools and stuff, right? This guy didn't, right? This guy didn't, for sure. No. Night vision goggles, so I think I've already sold all my extras. Yep, no, okay. Um... Well, let's go drop this stuff off and then we'll. Oh, wait, we'll check up here. We'll check up here. Let's just check up here really quick. Oh, they're getting a little rambunctious, aren't they? Uh, is there any traders over there? Doesn't look like it. No. 
Market Cafe. Looks like some sort of headquarters. Other faction. What is this? A toilet. Other faction. And. Where does this go? Just some deco? Okay. Hmm. Security, no access. There's not going to be traders there. Lockers. Eh. Oh, wait. Is there traders down there? Look at that. Oh, I can't jump over. Here we go. We'll go down here. Right? And then... Oh, crap. <laughs> I almost took damage. <laughs> Realize, oh! Okay. Um, freight and handling. Is there traders in here? Yes, there is. Nice. Hardware and this guy. This guy. Ugh. He won't buy my regular multi-tool. <laughs> Just... Uh, come on, really? No? No? Okay. What about, is there anyone else? Anyone else? No? No? Okay. No, well, at least they let you use their constructor. That could be totally handy. Free oxygen protected yeah this would be this would be somewhere where you'd where you'd want to like definitely try and come to if you're having a bad time okay um let's go back up to the ship drop the stuff off have something to eat before i start starving because i never brought any well i do have emergency rations on me it's not like i'm gonna starve it's just I haven't used any of my emergency rations yet. I'm kind of proud of that, actually. Uh, okay, so. Let's head back over to the ship. Can we just, where can we just get out here? Recreation area. Will that just let me out there? Can I just get out here? No? What about up here? Well, that's interesting. What's this? Oh, oh, you know what? This will tell us what we need. So we need Phoenix Fern, Aloe. So Phoenix Fern Fron, and the Plasma, of course. Uh, cactus Moss Phoenix Fern. Cactus Moss Phoenix Fern. And cobra leaves. Cactus, moss, phoenix, fern, cobra leaves. Cactus, moss, phoenix, fern, and cobra leaves. Okay. Can I get out anywhere? Can I... No, these are just apartments. I can't... Can't escape. What's out here? Maybe? No? Okay. Hey, can I... Oh, I can access it. But it doesn't open. Okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, what a tease. I can get into the fridge. In the. F yeah, look at that. Hey, we'll eat their food. Oh, hey. How handy is that? <laughs> I'm not going to starve. Yay. Okay. Um... Place is kind of a little bit of a maze. Oh, is that a berry bush? Oh, look at that. I'll eat. I'll maybe have some berries then. Huh? That's funny. Where'd they go? Oh, in my bar. How much you want to bet I get food poisoning from this? Okay, come on. And, oh uh, no! I uh, no! I made myself too cold. <laughs> okay. Uh, how the heck did I? Can I? Oh yeah, I can get out there. Okay, so let's jetpack. 
Let's head down there. Okay. And... Oh. Oh, hello. Hello, garden. Wow. Look at this place. It's got, like, pretty much everything. Um... Except for tomatoes. Almost everything you need. If you came here and picked this, you'd have almost everything you needed, and you could probably buy what you needed off, off, uh, off Aunt Mary's, right? Yep, tomato sprout right there. That's cool. Okay, so we wanted more confetti moss, right? And, um, Hmm. What else? I don't have space. I can put this down here, I guess. We needed the... F Was it the confetti moss or the fire moss now? Oh, I can't remember. There's two mosses. Uh, I know we need the phoenix fern frond. So we'll get those. And cobra leaves. Uh, I don't have the space. Okay. So let's let's hit the ship. Trading and hangers up. Okay. So I just went too far. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Head back over. Get into here and do relative safely and do this stuff. Okay, so f well, I guess I can eat something. Yeah. Um, actually, let's put those in the other fridge with this stuff. Yeah. And that just. Okay, so we've got fire moss, confetti moss. I've actually got quite a bit. We might be able to make a few here. And throw these in here. So, aloe vera plant fiber. So I have aloe vera at home. Plant fiber. Okay, good. So I should be able to make some more of the small ones. It's the big ones that I really want. So the cactus, confetti moss. So we need confetti moss. Confetti moss. Okay. Um, Phoenix fern, cobra leaves. Okay. I've got quite a few now, but I could still use a lot more of the large medi kits and the small medi kits okay so confetti moss confetti moss confetti moss and the fern prawn okay let's just put this stuff away here um we'll just put it in here for now And what else? We can put this back into here. And the O2 into here. Okay. Now let's grab that. And put that in a blocks. Oh, I did have crew. Oh, it's looking. Oh, I had it on the CV. Okay, well, it's okay. I can. Hmm. I kind of just want to sell them. I'd rather have the uh, other crew. Okay. It 
let's head back over and buy the rest of those confetti moss and phoenix fern frond scrapings and any cacti that I can get to I guess that was so now I can't remember was that all down where did I? Yeah, that was right here. Okay. Okay, so we want the confetti moss, which he's out of. Cactus. Phoenix fern. And, okay. Huh. Okay, that's all. That's it. That's all he's got. That sucks. Um, now, didn't he have some other gardening dude? There's another gardening dude somewhere. What does that go down to? Laboratories and maintenance. Huh. Oh, come on. Really? Whoa. Medical. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yes, medical. You don't sell, do you? Okay. Here, let's... Aha! Here we go. Yes, please. Oh! Ah, he didn't have that many. Okay, well, that's okay. We're getting there. So he has the cobra leaves. Oh yeah, cobra leaves. I can go up confetti moss. The cactus. Fern. Okay. Okay, we're doing we're doing pretty good. We can make some too, so we're doing good. I think we're going to be pretty good for healing. I think we're going to be in pretty good shape. So the cobra leaves. i got to go back upstairs and get the cobra leaves. All right. And you've I got everything from you now. Oh, wait. Let's get the uh, plasma, obviously. And I think that's it. That's all I need. That's all I need. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, um, it's not another guy, is there? Nobody else. No. No. Okay. Can't get these. No. 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 They're all locked. Okay. Okay. Just checking. Come on. Okay, well let's... What's up? Right. And the... He had the cobra leaves that I need to get still. Not much. Not much. Okay, I think that's it. Let's, um, let's head back to the ship then, right? I don't necessarily need to grab any of this stuff. Nah. Nah, they kind of nerfed. I'll show you something. I'll pick this and I'll show this to you. The texture plant protein used to be awesome. Now it's only worth 25 health. But it's good against poisonous bite. Hmm. Hmm. Good against poisonous bite. So that's good to remember. I'll just eat it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's some... Any other aloe? Another aloe? No? Okay. 
it's corn and stuff. So it's a it's a good way to get most of the um, plants you need for for what you for basically uh, everything except for looks like everything except for tomatoes is here. So that's kind of handy. Okay, so was that it down here? No. So there's still more. Um, repair station. Doesn't look like there's anything else. There's no dudes down here selling stuff. Nope. Okay. So. Fuel. And enter lock code. No, and that's the end of it. Okay, so let's. So that's it. Let's head back to the CV. And I would call this actually fairly s successful. Let's see what we can whip up once we get home. Arms and services. Did I check him already? Pretty sure I did. Yeah. I kind of want to buy more plasma cannon cells from them. Let's do that. Let's do that. So that's um, 86. We'll buy them all. Okay. I think that's it. Okay. Well, uh, I guess we'll head back over to the ship. And we'll head back home to Omicron. Kind of uh, uneventful for the most part. Killed a couple drones. We um, got some healing, more healing stuff from the trader. And we can check out Omicron Trader too. The, they should be restocked. So I'll do that. I can do that off camera when we... Actually, I don't want to put the stuff that's going to spoil in here. Actually, I'm, I'm going to grab it all and just put it all together. Yeah. Actually, just so I remember, a good amount of plasmas in there that all. Okay. Good. This is this is good. I'm gonna have a bunch of healing now. I was getting a little worried because I was under 20 of the large packs going into the uh, abandoned mine on hard it could be a little dangerous. So. I didn't want to didn't want to risk it and I think we're good so let's just uh, let's just fly home well I think I'm gonna call the episode here um, success we got our ore we've got our medical supplies we sold some stuff uh, I think we're actually better off than we were before we have 176,000 credits now we actually have quite a bit we have another you know almost 50, 50 some odd thousand credits more than we used to and more stuff so awesome um, and I'll just hang on let's get that into a better spot no um, here let's jump out and I'll see if I can get this up on the wall easier to see no nope. get it down here there we go okay and I'm level 25 318 kills with zero deaths 
that's the important one right there, zero deaths. So next episode, I'll probably be starting the abandoned factory and hopefully maybe even finishing. <laughs> um, and that will hopefully not be the last of my Iron Man episodes at that point. Well, guys, if you want to see when the next episode is, uh, subscribe and make sure that your notifications are turned on. And throw me a like there for this episode, and I'll, uh, I will see you guys next time. And until then, you have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.